Hello and welcome to Crew Mode to Match. My name is Greg and today we're going to be taking a look around this gorgeous Audi A3. It's the S-Line Sportback variant and it is Euro 6 compliant as well, coming with the satellite navigation system. As we move around to the rear of the vehicle, you will see a lot of sporty accents like the rear privacy glass, the spoiler and also the standout rear diffuser. Moving into the boot space now, there's plenty of it. There is enough there to swallow your weekly shopping with ease or even a couple of suitcases for that weekend away. Your rear passengers get to sit and look through the part leather and part cloth upholstery, with also the ice fix points as well and access to air conditioning units. As we move to the front interior, you're greeted by a decorative door insert, and given that this is the S-Line, it does have the S-Line embossed seats, again leather and cloth upholstery, which are highly sportive and highly comfortable. Moving on to the perforated leather wrapped multifunctional steering wheel, you've got access to the Bluetooth connectivity for your phone, cruise control and speed limiter and also a semi-digital dashboard up ahead. This does house every view that you could need for your day-to-day -day driving with the likes of multimedia functions and satellite navigation systems. Over to the infotainment system. This houses a wide variety of applications with the likes of Audi Drive Select which seamlessly changes the setup of the car. You've got access to your entertainment sound systems which does allow you to have your own personal concert and while you're there you might want to play that DAB radio. But if that's not to your music taste, not to worry as you can connect your own phone via the Bluetooth connectivity and this allows you to play your own music taste and keep you in touch with your family and friends. As I keep mentioning, this car does come with that satellite navigation system which does ensure that you're never lost even on them unknown roads and it's really easy to navigate around itself via the zoom in and out buttons. You can also keep up to date with the local fuel prices and parking information However, you will need to purchase a license for this via your local Audi dealership. You've also got Audi smartphone and also MMI settings allowing you to tailor this car to your own personal preference. Just by popping this car into the reverse gear, it does show you a visual aid for them front and rear parking sensors which are a dream and very handy in them tight seat car park spaces. Just below here, you do have the shortcut button for that drive select and that does quickly pop up on the screen there. And just below, you do have the dual zone climate control which is very handy and saves on a lot of arguments between the passenger and the driver as both can be at your preferred temperature. It's very easy to navigate around via the three dials and you've also got heated seat functionality with three different heat settings which is perfect for them cold winter months. As we now move on through the centre console you've got a storage compartment, a 12 volt power supply and two cup holders, there's your nice manual transmission, you've got the controls for the infotainment system and more storage compartments and USB ports underneath the centre armrest. 